Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Gemini with a clear, concise message from you. Alright, so let's see what's going on in the past for you, Gemini. Alright, let's see. The Ace of Swords. So you got some extreme truth, some clarity about a particular situation that was very taxing on your mind, on your heart. You just couldn't get away from it. It's like maybe you were trying to hide from the truth also, but it's like it's right there in your face. You know, um, maybe you got some uh, knowledge about something that caused a lot of conflict for you, but now you're at a place where you can resolve it. You know, or you, you're at a place where you're you're ready to um, hurt dissolve, okay? So maybe that could be a business, a relationship, or whatever. Let's see what the present energy is for Gemini. What's the present energy for Gemini? What is the present? Ooh, the Five of Swords. Okay, so it's going to be a, a test, a trial of your faith. Of just you know just life you know well being tested try, you know tried um so five of swords in the present energy so now you got this information in the past it's caused for some tough conversations maybe where you said some things they said some things this could have been about a third party situation or interference or how something was going backwards it was not going forwards as you thought that things were progressing you got information that you know no you know it's it's um it's regression happening here with the five of swords here. Uh, also, you had some some tough words between you and a loved one, or who between you and someone you thought loved you. What is the five of swords in the present here? It just seems as if this was an argument. You got some nine of cups. You got some information about maybe somebody having sex with or having fun with or somebody's doing something with someone else um yeah what's the future energy for gemini the knight of cups okay so then you maybe you have this is uh aquarius scorpio okay so it looks like you will have somebody trying to make you fall in love with them again. You definitely out of love with them, or it's just a tough time between you and this relationship. It's like you got knowledge about somebody else having somebody on the side, or having sex with someone else, or having fun, or just engaging somewhere else, or acting single. You know, this person is gonna come back to you, trying to make you fall in love with them again, trying to woo you, trying to you know. Um, they don't want you to leave. You know, this is a person who is, has unrealistic expectations in love. They don't know what love is. They don't know what a relationship is. They don't, definitely don't know how to maintain one. This is somebody who's not at a place where they want to be in a stable relationship. They just want, you know, they like the newness of love, you know, the beginning. So, um, let's see what the angel answers have to say for you, Gemini. I want to tell you it's up to you. If you want to take this person back, if you want to remain in this relationship, it is up to you. Um, you're ready either way, especially with the Ace of Swords, to either go or to stay. But it's definitely up to you. You know how you know it's up to you? You have no major arcana in this spread. So maybe you got some knowledge about something. Maybe you can get over it. Maybe you can't. Maybe this is just a monkey wrench that was thrown into the relationship. Maybe you guys can talk it out. Go to the therapy counseling I don't know but it's definitely up to you in terms of what you do or how you operate in this relationship because you do have somebody here trying to put you in a place of you know let's stay in love or let's fall back in love or you know I can change or I will change all right that's what I have for you if it resonates let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section go over to the website and book your reading there Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. Catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Join the channel. Get access to all the extended readings and ask me a question every month. All right. Thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.